Hello, my name is Matt Cole, and in this video, I'm going to cover briefly pedagogy then and now. So let's begin. So if we look at the word pedagogy in and of itself, it is primarily the method and practice of teaching. However, there are other terms used within this methodology. By definition, the pedagogu is a teacher, especially a strict or pedantic one. And this particular view or definition is essentially an insult or a negative connotation to it. Uh, this individual with the title pedagogu typically is a pompous individual. So in Greek, the word literally means to conduct a child to school and supervise his conduct. And there was a high emphasis on this term as we see it used in both classical and post-classical literature. Then there is the pedagogus, which means a tutor or guardian or even a guide boys. Typically, these were trustworthy slaves who were put in charge to teach morals and supervising the child's life. The pedagogu or pedagogus were used throughout Rome and Greece with the exception to Sparta, where the parents raised their children to the age of seven. The Spartans did not trust an illiterate slave with their children. So interestingly, you can see even then a choice of public versus homeschooling occurred. Within the Greece, the education was divided into three categories. It was writing, music, and gymnastics. Whereas within Rome, the education focused primarily on reading, writing, and mathematics. Today, when asked what the education system is focused on, i.e. pedagogy, you get different answers. So some would say it's focused on providing a quality education enabling the children to achieve their highest potential. While others might comment the student is to be more capable than when first initially started. And yet others would call today's education more of the modern education, providing the skills of science and technology, allowing the individual to excel in today's world. While the education emphasis and methodology have changed throughout time, pedagogy at its root has not. And the goal remains to teach and train the student to build them up with the knowledge and skills in order for them not only to survive, but additionally to thrive. 